Yo, hope you're well. You've read the title. Do you know what's going on? It's a bad day to be a banana. What we are setting out to achieve today is no small feat, guys, but at some point the banana will be eaten, and I'm just hoping that extra potassium is gonna get me through. All right, everyone, welcome to banana recording class. There are a few things you can do with your banana to get some sounds out of it. The first is flicking it. Uh, what's the second? Kick. You can throw it up and catch it. I mean, the most obvious one is going to be this. Bananas are actually really quiet. I just want to say I'm sorry for what I'm about to do. <laughs> this video is going to be fucking lit. It's just getting better and better. <laughs> Listen to the sigh of shame that I do. <laughs> and with that, we have our starting audio. It's not a lot, but it's potassium rich. The, I feel like a, I feel like a middle-aged science teacher with the jokes I'm making in this video already. This sucks. All right, here's the plan. I'm gonna go hard on drums first, and I'm actually gonna do that. There are so many moments I have in other videos where I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go work on the drums. And then I spend 20 minutes going down a synth design rabbit hole for a synth I don't even use. Anyone here like IDM drums? Pitch it down an octave. Great, I love how there's no bass there. This is exactly what you want in a kick drum. Now we're talking. Now try distorting it in Infiltrator. Oh, oh, oh my, oh, yeah. Did I just make a kick sound I actually like out of a banana? Okay, additional processing time. Another R bass. Oh, big thumpy. Don't want to lose that beautiful kick, which I just did. Two golden rules while producing, guys. The first is always look for something wrong, even if you can't hear it. The second is if you add one plugin to try and do something and that doesn't work, duplicate the plugin again, and then it might work. Don't listen to what I just said. Alrighty, guys, kick. We have a kick. That's me throwing it into the bin. Snare, I think. That's pretty cool. All right, just as a layer for the snare, maybe. Uh, a bit of body. Let's keep adding layers. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Cool, my dad is using power tools out the back. I apologize for any background noise. I'm gonna do my best to get rid of that. But I can only do so much. Anyway, this sounds like shit. That's pretty snary. You know, I might just bounce this snare as one layer. Pro tip, if you're in Logic and you're trying to bounce everything in a bus or just something in a bus, I've soloed this at the moment. Right click, create MIDI region, put it on the track that has the bus on it. And then if you bounce that, it'll bounce whatever is enabled within the group in there. We've got a little groove guys, a little drum beat. Because the samples that I'm making in this are mainly drums, I'm gonna drop a free little drum kit, uh, the banana kit. Link to download will be in the description. All right, I'm gonna try and make a synth. How are we gonna do this? We have nothing tonal. I got this plugin yesterday, it's called Chroma, and I'm gonna try and use this alongside some really heavy compression, maybe through Infiltrator, and see if we can get something melodic. Like, that's, that's a sick pad. Listen to it without Chroma. This is with. What genre is this, guys? Please let me know. I would now like to make a bass, an 808. I'm gonna take a tiny bit of this, drag it down here, and basically, I think I'm just making an oscillator, kind of. I'm just... Okay. That's been the most bass sounding. Let's see if we can add this in. We are so back. Okay, we have a musical arrangement. Thank you guys so much for being here. I'm gonna play the full thing now. Hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, leave a like. If you liked it a lot, subscribe. Also, if you like the kind of stuff that I make and you wanna get three free sample loops per week, you can sign up for my email list in the description below. I send out three new royalty-free loops each week for your use. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.